Chapter 17 On the Religious Life If you want to get along with others, it is necessary to curb your own will in many things. It is not easy to live in a monastery or a congregation, to remain there without complaint or reproof, and to persevere in your vocation. If you wish to remain steadfast in grace and to grow in virtue, consider yourself an exile and a pilgrim in this world. You must rejoice to be considered a fool and a contemptuous person for the love of God. Receiving the habit and the tonsure is but little help. It is the reforming of your life and the dying to self-love that makes the true religious. If you seek anything in religious life other than God and for the good of your soul, you will find nothing but trouble and grief and you will not persevere there in peace unless you strive to be the least and to be subject to all. It is good, therefore, often to remember that you entered religious life to serve and not to be served, and that you are called to suffer and to work, not to waste your time in idleness and gossip. In religious life you are meant to be tried as gold in a furnace, and you will not last long unless with all of your heart you are ready to humble yourself for the love of God.